My name is Enrica, I'm a teacher from primary school in Santia, a small town near Turin in the north of Italy. I'm author of Let's Make Our School a Growing Place Natural Based Solution Learning Scenario. My name is Anna and I'm a chemistry teacher in high school in Warsaw, Poland. I'm an author of one of the NBS learning scenarios called a Green School is a Healthy School. My learning scenario, called A Green School is a Healthy School, is dedicated for students between 15 and 19 years old. I'm Raya and I'm a primary school teacher in the European School of Brussels Swan in Berkendai and the author of The Traveling Fox, a nature-based scenario. The topic of my learning scenario is a foxy travel, a fox who likes traveling across Europe, accompanied by children attending kindergarten, first and second grade of primary school. The learning scenario has used materials and ideas from EU Commission's website OPLA and Naturevation, for example, Fox's photos and videos throughout your journey in Europe. Introducing the topic of NBS around students in every age is really important. It's interesting for students as most of them are really aware of natural environment conditions. Great amount of additional resources about NBS makes the lessons really interesting. Different examples that can be found, for example, at OPLA webpage gives the student broad that such kind of solutions are already in use all over the world. Any type of air pollution equipment are useful for the lessons according to my learning scenario, but it can be easily replaced by common mobile apps. To design my learning scenario, I use the OPLA to get nature-based solution examples and vertical garden models. I found very interesting three articles about the promotion of green wall at school and in other city places. Students learn a lot from NBS lessons and extend their knowledge with a very broad. In terms of skills, they develop civil engagement, critical thinking, communication and creativity across. Most of my students already proved their great awareness about environmental conditions, but after the lessons about NBS, they increase their knowledge a lot. They understand that starting from small steps, they can make a huge change and get positive effects on environment. Students were highly focused during the lessons and engaged in all the activities plans according to a learning scenario. I was afraid that the implementation of NBS topic for students won't be interesting, but I was so wrong. They get involved in the subject very fast and were really engaged in all the proposed activities. The learning scenarios allow children to develop their creativity, active citizenship and entrepreneurship. My students are very young citizens and before the learning scenario they had no information about the environmental problems. After the implementation they became more sensitive about the importance of green areas to save our planet. My students were very curious and cooperative. They put forward creative and interesting proposals on the design of vertical gardens. While planning your lesson with NBS learning scenario, it is recommended to collaborate with other teachers. It can be biology teacher who will discuss with students air filtration or air pollution impact on human body. But it also can be IC teacher that will help with creation of homemade sensors and collecting them. I would recommend every teacher to prepare NBS lessons for their students. It gives us as a teacher great possibility to improve our knowledge and awareness about climate changes. For students, it is important to show them real-life problems and show them that we can change a lot by small steps. I think that the implementation of a nature-based solution learning scenario is a great opportunity for teacher professional growth. You can develop new knowledge thanks to the many resources available in, the, in my case, I found help by consulting OPLA. In addition, the implementation also allows the class to work on social skills. 
it's a possibility to involve the local community and municipality in promoting activities of high civic and social value to find solutions together and united. Generally, improving the knowledge of our students about nature-based solutions is really important and it's really worth to spend some time to get our students involved in this subject.